It might surprise you to learn that over 2.2 billion people worldwide do not have access to that simple luxury that I just demonstrated. That is, reliable access to clean and safe drinking water. In fact, over 7,000 children under the age of 5 die each week due to illnesses derived from inadequate water. My name is Noah Ryan, and with my water test, we can turn the tides of this battle. Current testing approaches make use of fecal indicator bacteria, or FIB, to determine levels of fecal contamination in drinking water. However, these tests are time-consuming, taking 24 hours to complete. Organizations such as the WHO have stated that FIB are not appropriate surrogates for assessing the full diversity of pathogenic bacteria, viruses, and parasites, microbes that actually make people sick. As indicators, FIB are not necessarily themselves pathogenic. This has led to a number of false positives in water testing, where the presence of FIB has been incorrectly correlated to that water being unsafe for drinking. In light of these issues, UNICEF has issued a global innovation project challenge to design a test that can be performed in under 10 hours to simply and accurately identify fecal contamination in drinking water. My test satisfies all of these above requirements with the added benefit of being able to perform the entire test right at the lakeside. Since my method involves concentrating bacteria directly from the water source instead of culturing them like in an FIB test, I can generate results in less than nine hours. My methods involve a concentration phase, PCR amplification, and DNA sequencing. By targeting a conserved gene amongst all bacteria, I'm able to identify all the bacteria present in a water source and review my results to determine if any pathogens are present. The sequences are compared to a database to identify all the bacteria in my sample. This allows me to say with certainty whether or not the water would be safe to drink. A test like this could be used after extreme weather events to reassess water quality on a daily basis, or to determine which of two water sources in a rural village is safe to drink from. Clean water isn't just a dream, it's a future I'm building one test at a time.